So although we have a professional video coming that's going to explain these steps in greater detail, I wanted to put out a quick video just showing new users how they can access the capping station uh, and wiper blade underneath the print head when they need to do their daily maintenance. So first of all, the printer has been powered down and it is unplugged from the wall. It has no power connection to it whatsoever. I'm going to use the small white vinyl screw located here and I'm going to turn counterclockwise. So I'm going to go this way with the screw. And what we're looking for is to see the capping station area drop in here. You'll see something drop down physically. And at that point, you know that your print head is undock or unlocked and you can undock it manually with your hand. So this is an alternative to uh, starting a cleaning cycle and powering down the printer halfway through. So I'm going to go ahead and turn counterclockwise. And we're looking inside of here and you can also listen i feel no resistance on oh now i'm starting to feel resistance on the screwdriver and as i pull it down i see the plastic lock drop down the print head physically moves and i stop turning uh, once it's fully dropped so then i can reach in here with my finger and just physically push the print head out of the way and up here on top i'm going to go ahead and continue sliding it out of the way and if you look in close the capping station inside of here is what we want to access for cleaning. So I'm going to go ahead and take a, uh, a cleaning swab and imagine I had soaked this in cleaning solution already. You would come in here and you would just clean the top cap area around the, the borders and this middle boundary here. You want to make sure all the ink built up uh, has been removed from there. If you continue turning the uh, vinyl screw counterclockwise, the wiper blade will lift up and then you can access that as well for a good solid cleaning. Uh, the next video will show how to put it back together and turn it back on and we'll address that in just a moment.